Hey friends, this is Atif Opier. Well and welcome to the new update on Stellar. As in my earlier video Stellar, I was showing you that it broke out the resistance of the neckline of an inverse head and shoulder pattern on the 4 hour time frame. And this was the video by the way. And I was telling you that now there is a very high probability that the price line may soon break out the resistance of this parallel channel as well. And now if we take a look at the live chart, then you can see that it broke out the resistance of the channel and now it is retesting the previous resistance of the channel as a support. And in today's video, we will once again take a look at this move. And I would also like to share with you my most recent trade signal for Stellar that I shared a few days back on 7th of May 2023 with my members. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. So let's start analysis. And first of all, let me begin with my most recent trade signal for Stellar that I shared a few days back on 7th of May 2023 with my members and that was an expected harmonic bullish reversal bad move that Stellar was completing on a daily time frame chart with US dollar pair. In fact it completed the leg here but it was slightly moved up therefore I told my members that we can wait for the price line uh, and after some price correction we can buy it from the buying zone that was starting from 9 cents and goes to 8.7 cents. And now if I play this chart, then you can see that the price line dropped more down and entered in this buying zone. And I'm expecting that soon it will hit this sell target zone. You can see after the completion of this stack, it is geared up. Now let me to take you first on this weekly time frame chart. And here we can see that Stellar has already broken out a resistance of a very big falling wedge pattern. And after the breakout, it formed another rising wedge pattern. Right now, it is testing the support of this bigger rising wedge pattern. And at the same time, if we switch to the very small time frame chart on the four hour time frame chart, then here, uh, Stellar formed this parallel channel. And while moving inside this parallel channel, it formed this inverse head and shoulder pattern. And I was uh, telling you that once it will be able to break out this neckline of inverse head and shoulder pattern, then soon it can also break out that this resistance of the parallel channel as well, because the target for this inverse head and shoulder pattern uh, was here. That was approximately at 9.17 cents. And you can see that the price line has already hit that target. And after reaching or hitting that target, the price line moved down. And now it is retesting the previous resistance of the channel as a support. Now there is a probability that after this retest, the price line um, may start another price reversal to the upside. And now if we take a look at the target for this uh, breakout from this parallel channel, that is slightly higher than the target for this inverse head and shoulder pattern. Uh, that target is approximately at 9.27 cents. But in my point of view, now after this breakout, there can be uh, a possible move up to 10 cents where we have a quite long-term resistance. Uh, let me place a trend line here at 10 cents. Now we are, by the way, on the weekly time frame chart. And you can see that previously this level has been breaking as a very strong support here. And now here it was breaking as a resistance. And again, uh, it is into a very strong resistance therefore it will it is difficult for the price line to break it out but now after uh, breaking out this channel the price line can make another attempt to break out this resistance of 10 cents as well and once the price line will be able to break out this rising wedge pattern then the target for this rising wedge pattern after the breakout will be here that is exactly at this re long-term resistance of 16.2 cents and the final target for this huge breakout from this uh, big falling wedge pattern is here at the top of the wedge that is between 80 cents to one dollar so this was the update so far i hope that you have liked the analysis then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well and for more trading signals you can also join me and support me as a youtube member or as a patreon member because here i'm sharing different trading signals for you and you can find a link to join me here in the video's description i've shared take care goodbye